Hey guys, welcome. In this lecture, we are going to continue from where we stopped. Okay, now what we can do is over here, we can have the train comma and use control and S to save. Now, the reason for this train comma is in order for it to get formatted rightly. Okay, and now within the input decoration, it has a property known as prefix icon. And as the name implies, it means this is going to come first before something. And then we can use the SVG feature widget. And this is going to be dot asset. Okay. And basically, we want to use that search uh, SVG. To do this, we have to access, access the assets folder, the asset folder, and then the icons. And now the SVG, sorry, the search dot SVG. And this is going to be uh, wide, so what we can do, or it's going to be very big, so we can just reduce the weight to 10. Okay, use control. And you're going to see it somewhere, yeah? Okay, you can see it over there. And what we can do to make this a bit much more sim uh, smaller, we can just wrap this with a padding. A light and use control and dot. Okay, wrap with padding. And this is going to be for thin. Now, I've tried this before, and that is why we are going to get a right shape for this. Okay, you can see. So most of the time, you just have to try things out in order to get the right shape you so desire. Okay, for thin. Okay, seems good. And looking great. And what we can do lastly is... You can see basically we have this column and the reason for this column is because in general we want to have all our widget displayed vertically that is from top to bottom and as you know we can within uh, uh within the column we can also have uh, a row widget but in general all our widgets are being displayed from top to bottom right okay great and you can see this is the first a widget of the column and it is a row widget and this is the other widget basically for the test form field now what we can do is still within the column we can have a size box and the reason for the size box is because we want to give some breathing space between that uh, test field and the uh, uh, test we have there and these two widgets we have there okay sorry and this row okay and we're going to be giving the space vertically so this is going to be height of maybe 10 and use control and s to save and it's going to go a bit okay to the bottom you can see looking great or maybe we can just say for thin and if we wanted to give space horizontally this should be width right okay 